Hey what's up you guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, hi hello I'm Lydia and if you are new here make sure you hit the subscribe button, join the growing family. I want to hit 10k by the end of the year and I think we can do it. It's just a bit of teamwork. Share this video with others if you think it'll help. And yeah, let's get into this video. Yes, I'm wearing glasses. I, I'm supposed to wear glasses. I just haven't been for the last month because I didn't know where they were. And let's talk about healthy weight loss. So I'm diagnosed with EDNMS, which is an eating disorder. It's called EDNMS. It's eating disorder not otherwise specified. I've been diagnosed with this disorder for about 10 years now. I turned 27 this year. And the one thing I've never been able to do is healthily lose weight. Until now, I take an injection called Trulicitine. I've gone from being 76 kilograms to 68 kilograms in about two to three weeks. I was quite surprised when I saw that I was 68 kilograms. Because it was literally December, I weighed myself and I was 76 kilograms. But I'm, what I want to say to you is if you're in eating disorder recovery, especially EDNOS and binge eating disorder, it is possible to lose weight healthily without restricting, without nighting, without exercising. Because you've got to remember some people that don't have physical capabilities of exercising. I can't exercise in the minute because I've got a torn tendon in my knee. And if you want to know about my knee, I'm doing physio and these are my exercises. Do I do the exercises? Yes. Is my knee really hurting because of the exercises? Yes. Have I emailed to him to say that I hurt my knee? So I'm doing these exercises that hurt. I think the idea is to build up strength in my knee because it, my knee is very weak. I'm currently standing purely on my left leg. Also, I've been banned from buying cuddly tweezers. So, oh, naturally, I snuck in. Picky! But yes, weight loss with eating disorders is obviously a complicated subject. Now, I'm not telling anybody to go and starve themselves. I'm not saying if you're fat, you should exercise. I've got nothing against anybody. If you're in anorexia recovery, this video may not be very helpful to you. But as someone with EDNMS, I can say I haven't been restricting and all in all I'm doing well with weight loss. I'm back into a size 10 in clothes. I was at a 14 so that made me happy. I mean I can get rid of some of the bigger size clothes because I am never going back to that way. I'm trying to beat my eating disorder. I've been eating out and I'm smashing that. I just think it's important to reach out to people. If you're struggling with an eating disorder, let's reach out, let's help with a group chat, you know? You're not alone. There are plenty of support groups on Facebook. Oh, I reached my step target. Yeah, that's rock. I did have to walk to my appointment, it took about half an hour this morning, because my buses were sort of running that way. There is, it is possible to healthily lose weight in eating disorder recovery. And I think that's all I've got for this video. Thanks for watching and I will see you in my next video. Peace.